winter is back. My youngest son just uh, fed the cows their hay. And it's rained like crazy for about two days and last night it turned into snow. It's gotten a bit colder. So this is uh, Monty our bull and Hooper our red Angus who's part Hereford. They like to hang out together. And I'm going to walk down to the other batch here. This is 59, who we creatively named because her ear tag, when we bought her, had 59 on it. And her little calf, who's half Highland, is also creatively named, in a way. Uh, her name's 60. We're only seeing the back part of her now. She looks a lot like her mom, but she's a bit shaggier because she's part Scottish Highland. She's about six months old. She was born on the farm. And this wooly little guy is Gormley. And Gormley is about six months old also. He was born, I think he was born first, and then 60 was born like the very next day. And he's Cooper's calf, the Red Angus, who was over by Monty the Bull. And he's obviously half Highland. He really, really looks wooly. He looks like he's going to be a big boy, too. And this girl up here, we call her Queen. She's kind of a mystery to us right now. She's, she's about two years old, but she's never had a calf. So we're going to have to look into her situation. We were hoping that she would have a calf, and then we just keep Monty and three cows and that's kind of a nice number here for us at least at this moment so it looks like we're gonna have a nice winter storm or we're in the process of having one in the Northeast in the US we, of course, are up in the Appalachian Mountains in western Pennsylvania. It could be just raining down at the bottom of the mountain. Sometimes it is up there. Uh, it'll, be, it'll be snowing and, and down there it'll be raining. We really get a lot of weather up here, which is why we uh, chose the Scottish Highland bull. We had some Scottish Highland cows too, but um, they don't mix well. With the, with the Angus cows, they tend to, to bully them a lot. Uh, so we're, we're going for, for now, we're going with Scottish Island bull and Angus cows. We like the calves, they don't have horns, but they're, they're wooly and pretty cold hardy. Well, I'm gonna go back in and get some breakfast. Talk to you later.